Hi, this is James Page for Soldier Mod TV. I've managed to take a small amount of time out to come over and talk to Stephen Croft from Enterprise Control Systems. Thank you very much for joining us. Um, you've been wandering around and uh, seeing everything that's here today. What have been your impressions of the show so far? Well, James, I, th I think it, things seem to have really bounced back. You know, obviously, COVID knocked us all for, for six. But this is the first show I've been to since, since the end of COVID where it, there's a real buzz to it. There's so many people as well. It, it's, been, it's been fascinating to, to see that actually the industry has come, has come back to life again after all this time. It does. and it, it feels like there is a real buzz around the place. Has there been anything in particular that you've been looking for? Anything that's uh, impressed you as you've been going around? Yes, in particular, I've been looking at the, the unmanned aerial vehicles, the, the drones, if you like. The manufacturers there are here and there are plenty of them who are exhibiting at, uh, at Eurosatory and that's because we have a brand new system which is tiny, lightweight but has fantastic performance as a data link system between the drone and the ground which will provide any user with extra capability that they don't have at the moment. So I've been looking at the UAV manufacturers talking to them to see what they use at the moment and seeing how our product can slot into their drone. I see, and, and one of those uh, key components of being able to slot in is, is size and scale? Absolutely, so it's what it's size, weight and power, really. Um, it, it depends on the UAV, is it a quadcopter, is it just winged, how big it is, but generally, at the moment, our data link for large air platforms like helicopters weighs something in the region of 3.2 kilograms. Our new system, which we've called TOVE, weighs 400 grams, but still provides the user with a great deal of capability. Not everything that, that our current system does, obviously, but it is actually something that we think will bring an additional thing to the party, if you like, for drone manufacturers. Right, well, thank you very much. That sounds like a really interesting development. Best of luck with it and, and best of luck for the rest of the show. James, thanks very much indeed. Thank you.